The winner of this bowling tournament, besides the typical prize money, will also receive this Arcade 1-Up Golden Tea Mini Arcade Cabinet. The cabinet stands 3 feet 9 inches tall, perfect for sitting down. It includes a 1-foot riser to bring it up to 4 foot 9, bringing the trackball up to standable height. Check out this and many of the other arcade games and cabinets they have at Arcade1Up.com. Arcade 1-Up and Tastemakers have no affiliation with this contest or any part with it. It was a close battle the whole way through. In the end, Dave Madela, the second time he's ever made it on the show, has done something he hasn't done the first time, and that's win and move on. How will he do this time? There's only one way to find out. Welcome everyone to uh, week two, off season, King of the Palace, sponsored by Watch Me Suck Air Bowling and our good friend George. Woo! I'm Dave Matala. Last week you watched me like barely beat Ray Weatherby. Now I have a whole new opponent and Mr. Richie Myrick. Now a long time ago, Richie Myrick and I actually did battle before and I almost had him. By that much. It was close. That much. I think Steve was like laughing at me. But Richie, here we are again, man. Season two. How you feeling, kid? Here we are, and I'm feeling good. I'm, I'm looking forward to another great match with you and uh, another season of this stuff. I mean, whatever you can call it. Dude, we're here to have fun. That's Nothing right. serious, man. So if you see me make a face at him or if he makes a face at me, it's all good. I love the guy. All right. Tune in. New England Candle Pins, man. Here we go. Thank you so much. Let's do it. Hi, so Welcome everybody to King of the Palace Summer uh, Edition, pin, week the, number two. Come back. Dave's still in, oh, it wouldn't go in the pit, it facing come off and go back. Host versus yeah. host. Yeah. If you do a ball fast, Ray go, go, by just I a did a lot. Last week. I threw a fast ball back yeah. then. I, Which show is going to win this one? Come back. King of the Palace or New England Candle Pins? Richie Myrick starting out on lane three. Yep. It's a battle with the Candle Pin shows. He was fourth seed with a 630 roll off score. Look at this Rick, and Richie, beautiful first ball delivery and leaves a <clears throat> two, four, six, seven. He's from East Hampton. He bowls out of Canal Lanes and won a 114 average. He also bowls out of Exeter, New Hampshire. I've been there once. He did bowl a fun time, but fun time uh, closed in a couple years ago. Fun time is no longer fun. Nope. No. Nope. And he, it ran out of time. He put R R I P. Rest in peace. <laughs> Where was Fun Time Lines? Holyoke. Holyoke. Oh, Holyoke. Yes, Holyoke. Yeah. It was a pretty fast house. I heard. It was. Well, the, the, the pins delivered the ball into the park in the first box. Got nothing. <coughs> got the head pin again, and he oh. gets nothing again. He's got some wood. What's going on here, Rick? I don't know. Just, I mean, four, six, seven. Amber, you can't throw the ball, but with the storm. Humidity, maybe hot day. I, I, I don't know. know. Are you? Do you agree that a, a humid day? Affects pinball. Oh, oh, it does. Oh, yeah. it, it affects the. Uh, affects the oh, it affects the um, the wood. Wood, yeah. And the rain humidity. You can't slide. Yeah. It no, I, I, I couldn't slide. I couldn't slide that good. The very it humid. It swells up the wood. The heat. Yeah, the, the humidity and the heat. Just, it's like swells up the. Well, the it's land. awkward weather. Yeah. It's awkward weather right now because it's like 80 degrees, but it's also been raining. I know we came here. It came here. It was fine. It was pouring. We came here. It was pouring. Everything was casting dogs. It was coming down. Dave Madela. David. The important thing is no clouds. Dave Madela on alley three. Yeah. See if Dave can Dave can keep it going from the first uh, match. Dave's getting a four pin. pin. Dave's getting a four pin handicap. Baby split. Three seventy. Yeah. Yeah. Actually, yeah. Two seventy rather. For anybody yeah, who watched. Some wood. Anybody who watched last oh, week, he actually got a four pin handicap right. last time. I mistakenly yeah, put six, but he still took the match by four last week, regardless. Come on, David. Show us the Oh, up the wall, baby. Oh, oh not hard enough. He, he says he works for a safety manager for a telecommunications <coughs> company. And he owns a palace where he's born now. Yeah. 
Oh, he's moving over to lane number three. Four. 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 Thank it's you. like three, but one more. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Three plus one's four. Yes, right. Second he, box. The String number one. On the head pin again, and look at this. Uh, Another split city. Oh, look I don't like this. that. Wow. The what seven, eight, and ten. What do you think of that? He hits the head pin. He fits the park, ball in the park, right and the leaves seven. this. Yeah. What's going on here? Like, it's like crap. Oh. You got to hit the slam the front wood red line. Yeah, hit it. Yep. Yeah. You got to get it going. He did. He did. Uh, oh. Oh. No. Yeah. Well, the pins aren't moving today, like Steve. No. Yeah. I hook it in by the other side. So Not the yeah. usual palace we know and love. No. Yeah. Pins fly around like the wind. Uh, I'd have to say the palace is a. Uh, it's it's a, an honest house. Yeah, but some days they fall really well. That would be, uh, be a nine, nine, be a nine ball. It's, it's more honest it's now. now. It's usually a fast place. Legitimately yeah. fast. Natural fast, as they call it. Yeah. And I don't know. That's been disproven a couple times. There's been a few people that were saying that before, and they came in and still a little bit faster than others, but they were like, okay, never mind, because they bowled off. <laughs> well, so, it's not as fast as the other house in, in Pitch Pittsburgh, Putnam Lanes. Oh, that, God. that place yeah. is so fast. On the head yeah. pin, and he leaves. And look I've at proven this. many times on video, and even went up to the pin plates to prove it. There's no juicing. No juicing. He has a ten pin plate, and he keeps it within like a ten thousandth of an inch uh, flatness, which is ridiculously tight. Oh, which is how you get the moving. pins to slide around over there. Yep. He's gonna go way left, I think, in the wood here. I hit it low, but it was moving. Just, Waiting for it to stop moving. Yeah, it's moving around a little bit. Sometimes pins move around for a while. Oh, you gotta wait for the. I would say you gotta wait for it to stop. I would have to hit a low. Who knows? Or at least it appears to stop. Or blow the red line. Oh, oh, oh no! Not Thought the ball was gonna come back and hit it oh, for a minute. Oh yeah, ball. Well, these pins are moving today. <clears throat> the most amazing thing is whoever I usually bowl with, and I was a, uh, I was just a. Uh, fill in the uh, whatever, the pacer the pacer just so that everything would stay and I usually bring the bad luck with people that bowl with me he actually made the show so yeah, I he guess did. he broke the curse yeah yeah he well, did after three boxes Merrick hasn't gotten any marks but he hasn't missed a single pin either so far he's got a yeah, perfect all tens. game yeah all tens oh. and yeah no max yet in this match he's on the head pin though he has another one. Oh, well, there there oh there's a strike and nice the ammo. Ammo. The nice that. ammo. Wow. One three pocket. Still a perfect game. He, he deserved that one. That was, yeah. a, that was, a, that was a good ball. I wonder if you heard me saying that he didn't have any marks yet. In yeah. candle pins, unlike the other the other two bowl, types of bowling, so long as you get all ten pins down, it's considered a perfect game. So a minimum perfect game of a, is a hundred. The unachievable three hundred's the max. Mm. World record's two forty five. I have never bowled a perfect game in Kinop, and I had a, a 97 game. I've got as far as four frames perfect, and that was at the grease pit known as Acton Bolodrome. Oh, Here's really? an interesting yeah. question everybody asks every now and then. What's your highest game without a mark? 97. Oh, that's yeah. it. I had 88, and I had an 8 box and a 9 box. Yeah, I, get, I had a 96 once. I, I did it. I had a, the 8 box, 9 box, I had a spread eagle in the back pen. So it was like a lot was of pressure. There was a lot of pressure on you. You get that. You're going for yeah. a perfect game, you have a spread eagle and, and, and a back pen. <laughs> It's like you chop one and you then you're done. You know? Mine like, was a 92 tough. for the longest time, and then like maybe a month or so ago, month and a half, it was the end of fall league. Yep. I, I got a 94. I was like, yeah, I'm getting high. You know what? I, you know what? I, I've I've, got, I've gotten like marks and all tens for a perfect game, but I've never seen a hundred game with no marks. Never. All my years of bowling, I've never seen it. Imagine, imagine yeah. that. I'm sure somebody's had to have gotten one. I, I never, I never seen happen. it. I never seen it. It could happen. Yeah, I never. Dave has the old uh, dreaded half Worcester again. His favorite shot. Halfway back to Worcester. Speaking of speaking of the shot, Rick, how many spare leaves are there in Candleton? Oh boy, I had to think that one. I got to. Um, I, figured this, I figured this. I figured this one out. Nice shot, Dave. You're absolutely Let's right, Judge. So he cheated. He probably Steve, had to do it. I told me the answer last year. <laughs> yeah. I don't teach uh, my phone. I'd have to like look at my phone and add it. No, all. I've asked mathematicians that question. Wow. But you know what they all forget? Everyone said it's a hundred it's a thousand twenty two. Thousand twenty two. Well what they forget is you can throw your first ball in the gutter. Yeah. Oh that's a spare yeah, that's yeah. a spare too. And, they, and then and they forget the so that makes yep. it yeah, and then that that's a spare lead. Which in candle pin bowling is known as an Emily. An Emily? A what? Emily. What, 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 what backup. Backup. Throwing a gutter ball the first ball? It's called if an Emily. If you miss everything on ball one, get them all in ball two. It's referred to as an Emily. Really? Oh, 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 oh,
does our hair on double time. A double, for a double strike Mary. for Richie Marriott. Uh, and then when you I... get all of them down on the first ball, they call that a strike. Wait a minute, give them back to the family. Where'd you pick that up? That's it. Uh, I think it was in the actual rule book. It was in what, some documentation on how the game works oh, and thank jargon. You. Thank you, Drew. He's, thank you, Drew. He's, going for, a tri he's going for a triple strike Let's here. Let's see if he can get the triple. Just yeah. like people say what you call a turkey is wrong, but I've seen it proven in other places. Oh, boy. Oh, right there. Triple. Oh. Oh. Richie. Oh. Yeah, yeah, Myron, heavy Richie side, yeah. No, Thought he had, had it. A little on the heavy no, side. see, Rick, he's strong. What's he in the sixth box? Uh, yes. He's thrown three, every time he set the head pin, three times he had a rotten aim, and he's got two strikes, yep. and he's got... Oh, oh. Wait, oh, 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 wait, 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 wait a minute, wait a minute. Roll back. He's gonna hit it? Nope. Not hard enough. Nope. He's hit the head pin. Yep. He the feast of famine. Two strikes, yeah, right. That's what it is. Three, spl three splits and, and two strikes. Yeah, that's what it is. Uh, actually, four splits. Sports, All Richie just did was make it so that Dave has to bowl. <laughs> yeah. Really well, man. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yeah, when you get double nine, it nice pins that up a lot when you get double nine in a ten box. They are, they are, they are fast. No, Dave's going to get it going. Well, this is actually almost a, kind of like a rematch between the two as well. You know, these two went off at it at the nor in the normal season, and now they're back at it again. Hmm. Well... <clears throat> I made the show about uh, three or four years ago when me and Ray Weatherby and we had to bowl Richie his pot. We, we lost the final match to Richie and Aaron Spiller so for the title. We lost. Yeah, he's got a two Rich, 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 Richie's some... tough. He's a good bowler. He's a great I've bowler. come close a couple times. One of the times I only missed by three pins. Were you, in the, you, by eight. Were you in the mixed doubles too? You bowled the mixed double, didn't you? Not on the show. Just a, just a singles one? Yeah. All right, Dave gets a spare. The mix, the mix doubles, I missed by eight. Did you? But I actually, that one, that, the last you? one that we just did. Who did you bowl with? Well, the mixed one that we had is you go in by yourself and you get paired up. Yeah, you paired after. up, yeah. Um, but even if I would have made it, I wouldn't have been able to go. I no. wouldn't have been, no. See if Dave fills a spare. Oh, right, I, right side, right. Even then, I was too right oh, oh, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh. Wow. Look at this, people. Wow. Six, Get not, six. Not bad for the ocean. He hits, From El Stinko he hits the six pin, he gets the six drop. Yeah, yep, yep. Huh? Unbelievable. A little extra action on that ball. He needs some wooden play. As Rob Gamir would say on Candle Pins for Cash, the Fa Hasman. <laughs> yeah, is he, isn't he in jail by now, I think? I think he's in jail. I think he's hurting on that one. Yeah, I think he's in jail, I think. Yeah, I don't want to say what for, but I think he's in jail. See if Dave can get 10 blocks here. Yep, cleans him up. Always easier on the third ball, isn't it? Yeah, he went to the left on his first ball. Looks like he's threatening. Look like at his hand's threatening again. Yeah, he's having some issues with his hand and his arm and stuff. It's yeah. like a oh, nerve, yeah. Yeah, he, nerve running down. You can tell he's really having a tough time over there. He's already bowled how many strings? Three and five. five six, six, so six, this is his eighth string? Yeah, today. yeah, it's not easy. Probably cooperated in the previous game. Richie Myra, a couple of lean number three. Finds the wow, head. another hammer. We got wow. a four box of strikes. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Three. Wow. Three, wow. three out of four. Three out of four. And the other one, he buried and left a seven, eight, ten. I know. Figure it out, Rick. Tell me. How uh, does that I, happen? I, I Tell me. I'm all these. I can't. I'm born 40. I can't. It's just double. Oh, double. Man, you know, as soon as wow. This time he hits the one, two pocket. Wow. And buries it with a double. Nice ball, Richie. Nice ball. I feel like I don't want to be Dave Mandela right now. And Dave's in, uh, he's in tough throw. His, his, hand, his hand's hurting. His, and, uh, his hand and arm's hurting. Richie's yeah. throwing strike yeah, after strikes. Yeah, he's got he's, four. This is almost a replay, guys. Yeah. Four out of five boxes with strikes for Richie <laughs> Byron. Yep. Talk about candle pin bowling at its best. Wow. And the one he missed on, he left a 7, 8, 10. And, and we, and we were commenting how there weren't strikes being thrown. Now all of a sudden, and, and was, yeah. all of a sudden now there's strikes. So, it's yeah. a crazy game, Bolton. You never know what's going to happen. If it's going to get a strike there, yep. or at least a spare strike. Oh, not too bad wood. If he yeah, plays the wood, he might get He's left a 2 four, seven. He's going to hit red line in. Yeah, he has to, yeah he's going to split the 2 and the 4. He can't hit, can't hit too low. Or you go for the wood. Domino oh, effect. Oh, oh he pulled it. Clean. Yep. That's what you're afraid of. The, don't hit the cap. You yeah. want to play the cap, so you go... You're kind of afraid of the cap, so... Yeah. You should have played the wood. I think I would have played the wood. Oh, he went off again. 
Well, he was shooting the three seven, two seven, better known as the, the baby, baby split, split. But, and the baby cry. <laughs> <laughs> What's a two seven eight? Is that the baby split too? Or no. Two seven eight with the ribbon. And a thousand. No. I think I actually added that wrong. Can you? Uh, yeah, sure I can. And the full horseman. Looking at oh, you did. You did. Yeah, I did. F thirty forty. 57, As we right? can clearly see on the Yeah, it should be 27, 57, that should be 76, 86. I just caught it and I'm like, wait, well, wait no, no I problem. didn't do that right. No problem. Wow, that's a big oh, eraser. <laughs> Holy mackerel. Jesus, Mark, you're throwing all these marks and I ain't even that's, adding it right Well, now. it does say a big mistake. Well, that's a big eraser. For those of you wondering, this is the eraser he's talking about. Wow, that's a big, <laughs> that's a big eraser. Wow. And he oh, you, can, you, 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 can erase, you can erase your life with that one. Erase your life or yeah. your life. <laughs> wow, that's that a That might one. be the same thing for some people. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's like Dave struggling over there. He's having a tough time and uh, there's pain. I think, yeah. I think the uh, I think the pain gods have paid him a yeah. visit on He's, he's yeah. had some and, trouble with his nerve in his shoulder. Yeah, and Richie's going really well, so well, it's going to be go. tough. Richie Myrick going for a triple. Going after a triple. Again, Box number nine. second try. Box number nine. Yep. Him I, oh, oh, how oh. is that? Oh, love of my God. goodness! The love how, of does God. That, how does that happen? I, you know what? You can bowl the 80 years in bowling. You never, you never know what happens. Gets the spread eagle on a double strike. Yep. Yep. Now you're seven. Wiped out the three in a right. Let's yep. play for the ten box. Yep. I don't. Know. I have no idea, Rick. I'm sorry. I, you know what? I'm with you, Steve. I, I don't know either how it happens. How, how can you throw four blocks? Uh, Richie dropped that one. He knew it too. And they throw the same ball again to get a spread eagle. Well, hit a seven, eight, ten. Right. And then he had the spread right. eagle. And your spread eagle. So six boxes. He should have had six strikes. Imagine that. The ball was there every I, time. I've never seen six no, boxes in a I've row. I've seen four. I've seen five a couple times in a row. And oh, now he's at five? Yola's yeah. ice cream yeah. stand. This, this guy, uh, Bob Sterling. Rockwell, he's a, uh, a pro bowler years ago at Metro West in Framingham. Dave's in some five trouble, in guys. Yeah, five strikes in a row, he did it, yeah. Yep, now he had a half worst and he went in the Everybody's hole. Everybody's good at finding that hole today. And half worst. What's he at, 130? 135. 135 going to the last one. Oh, just don't want to find it again. Wow. These are big out here. Oh, oh no, two more. Welcome to Mason's. Oh my goodness, four blocks. <laughs> four blocks to end it. <laughs> what do we yeah, but, yeah, but he wouldn't have won he wouldn't have one thirty nine game if it was at Mason's uh, Georgie. He wouldn't have won one thirty nine if it was at Mason's. I think he would have got like a seventy there. He would have two doubles if he was at Mason's. Yeah, he had two doubles. No spares, <laughs> yeah, right? No spares. You imagine that? Yeah. Two doubles and no spares. That's crazy, isn't and it? And he hit the head pin nine eight out of ten times. Yeah. Uh, Richie uh, just ended that game with one thirty nine. Dave's in his at his eighth box in eighty two. He's in some trouble, guys. Yeah, he needs a like twenty box. Well, twenty twenty. He needs a, Well, he needs like two spares and twenty you know, ten fills. Oh, he's got a break here. Yeah. Look, the one nine. A lot of wood. It's either gonna help him or hurt him, though. Just hit the like any combination, hitting that head pin. Yeah. Straight at it. Right? Anywhere light fold yeah. should have it. Doesn't matter, light fold. He's got to hit. Oh no! He pulled it left. Oh! Candle pin oh. ball. There it is. The bowling gods, people. Thanking the bowling gods for that. He completely one. misses his object, Rick, and he, he have a he charge, it, and he and he, he gets a spare. He, he threw it in the ocean. He threw in the ocean. He got it. He knew he missed too. As soon as he let go of the ball, he's like, ah. Oh. And That's what OETV is right now. <laughs> the question was. What ocean did he throw it in? What, what ocean did he throw it in? The Pacific the Ocean or Atlantic Ocean? What, what ocean was that, Richie? The Atlantic or the Gulf? What or? ocean? Pacific and his own ocean up on that one. <laughs> Unbelievable. Oh yeah, they all had pit. Oh, oh, no, no. But oh, that's 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 again. You guys know all well. That's why it's never easy. All right. There we go. The, the Cleary is. again, uh, Georgie. That's your yeah, favorite <laughs> shot, George. Well, four My Hotsman favorite's a strike. Him. Yeah, well, well other, other than a strike. He's got to throw the strike ball again. He's got some wood in it. Oh, you want to laugh. Maybe. Well, well you but know, Blade, uh, Johnny Blaze actually pointed out earlier is when Dave throws his ball, he throws it pretty much from right to left. Yep. With his arm hurting, I think he's dropping it more. And yeah. it's going even farther left with the maybe a tweak of pain or something like that. So I've noticed there's been quite a few shots that he just overthrew to the left. Ten. Ten blocks. Showed. He showed the bowling gods what he thought so of. So that, that's with the handicap already added? With handicap already so added, Dave has a 107 against Myrick's 139. So he's got a 32 pin lead at the one. 32 pin lead. What's his handicap? Uh, 20. It's four. Four? Yep, it's four Myrick's pin. had 28 with the handicap from the next string though. So 28 pins yep. right now. Obviously, two uh, double strikes. 
That's all we got. No money. I know. Imagine that. No spades. No spades. No spades. The two doubles. Somebody must have bought them. All right. Just clearing up some math, making sure everybody's right. It's a shame that Myers uh, throwing all those marks. We gotta make sure everything's right. It's a shame that right. David told. What do you think today's oh, that's okay. number two in candle pin? What would it cost you Dave, for, a for a brand new oh. machine? We're ready. I would say probably 10, <clears throat> 10, yeah, 10 to twelve grand. Yeah. Well, the pins are forty dollars a piece, right? There you go. Good ball, Dave. Off the uh, two and the four. With wood in front of it. Forward for him. He's got a piece of wood right in front of the two pin. It should be automatic. Better known as what, Nick? Rick? I don't know. Yeah. Bond, piece of wood. wood. It should be automatic, but. Bond wood or a plank. Yep. Spare. That's automatic right there. Dave's in a lot of pain, though. I think he came over, his shoulders killing him, too. Well, you know, last week, though, we saw Ray with his first game. He only had one mark, and then the last game. It exploded, yeah. It exploded. He only. Judge. Came a couple different. Judge, so. what if you throw two gutter balls? You never know. You he, he just, he just, he just, he just looked like he's in a lot of pain, though. Yeah. He's uh, no, that's shrugging his shoulder thing. and just his facial expressions. It's what? Yeah. That's yeah. when you. I've been there. That's before. when you get a spare from missing. I everything broke my in leg like four or five years ago. Oh. You remember that? I still, I'm no, still in pain a lot, so I know how you feel. And then you throw your second ball and you get a spare. That's an Emily. That's an Emily. All right, now you throw your first spare. It's weird. Now, what if you throw he, your first he, he two balls the in the three, gutter, then you throw a strike? The three, right. six, and nine ten. pounds. Is that an a ten? I'll call it a ten. Okay. So, uh, Emily's eliminated. Yeah, Emily's a spare lead. A little left leaves a one. I mean, one, eight, a spare ten. lead, but a spare. Oh, look at this rough shot. Yeah, uh, one, eight, and ten <clears throat> pin. Going for, going for a ten box? Yep. Yeah. Lucky if you get two pins out of here. Yeah. Wow, no. I got one. He went around huh. the 10-pin. Not what I thought was going to fall down when he yeah, didn't he, uh, he's in, uh, he's I, I feel for Dave. He's, uh, hey, Rick, he's, he's figuratively hurting. and unfortunately, he's, he's, he's being a trooper, though. He's going. Yeah, how how he's fast do you think he, from the foul line to the head pin, how many feet is it? 60 feet. All right, how fast you have to throw the ball to make contact with the head pin from the foul line? Do it in one second. I know the number. 60 miles an hour. 60 miles an hour. 40.9. 40 point yeah. In the old days, I threw about 40 miles an hour. Where? When I was 18 years old, 19 years old. I you got clocked at 40? Oh, yeah, about four, I was talking about 40 miles an hour. Where'd you clock it? The only place I know that's got candle well, and bone wow. well, is Miller's. Well, what? My Eric just managed the last to go few years around ago, the head I, I stopped at 34, 35. Yeah, the slowest domino yeah. effect I've ever but seen. When I was younger, I threw a lot harder ball. Of course, I was a young was kid. I was, only, I was only 19, 20 years old. Yeah, but, but how were you able to determine No, that? I assumed I, I, assumed I was, you know. I well, actually. Ulster was kind of, he was the fastest bowler. Oh, I think, yeah. That was a really was hard nine box. When that, that took a lot when of When I do mine, and I'm able to have the camera in the next lane over, I count frames. I know where the ball is when it hits the foul line and count frames in base mine. Sometimes if I'm throwing quote unquote fast, I'll hit 30 miles an hour. Yeah. Otherwise I'm hitting around 20, what's, uh, 29. What's some of Myrick's information? What's his favorite and least favorite shot? His favorite shot is a a chilled Sambuca. That's, not, mean, that's, not, that's not a bowling weave, is that? I don't know. As far as I know. Oh my what that God, strike is. I don't know. I think we should just change that to a strike at this point. <laughs> he keeps getting them. And, and his least favorite is a two penna. Which what? Two penna? A seven ten maybe? Yeah. Uh, well, no. yeah. I mean, nobody likes that. <laughs> no, no, no. Even which, the one five isn't cool. What just happened on that strike? He, he threw a strike. No, there's a word for that. But there's a, a term. A strike? When it's a slow motion strike where a piece of wood rolls up and hits the last pin down. Uh, messenger? No, no, no. Messenger is when a piece of wood rolls up and hits a pin, but when you when it gets a strike, what do they call that shot? Nobody knows but you, Steve. Uh, he, I gotta find it. I gotta do my <laughs> research here. <laughs> Steve don't even know. See, I, well, just, ocean ball. I guess, uh, if you don't know, Steve, how are we gonna know? Well, that's a... You gotta tell us. A diff weird one leave. four rate ten. Well, that's a weird leave, huh? Look, I it, look it up for next month. Yeah, he, I gotta he, find... He, I heard it somewhere and I could get... He's got some wood in there. He might have a shot at it. Gotta get contact with this... Nice shot. Oh, he right. leaves the eight ten. Nice bid. Now he's left the eight ten. Yeah. I feel like he had to go a little bit more left. Ironically, he's been for a while. Yeah. Let's see if you can get at least oh, one pin. Shooting eight ten for ten box. It should be the wood. You might have a ten box there. Yeah. Yep. Nice, nice shot. shot. Nice ten. Nice ten. Nice angle shot. Well, if Angle you're gonna miss a mark, at least get a ten, right? Yeah, it's gonna be tough. Dave's gonna throw some uh, a lot of marks here together. Maybe a double here to get back in the match. 
You know, many years ago when I was almost in the pro tour, but in a real big professional league, I got mad yep. one time because three lefties beat me out. Really? So I made this rule the next year that if you're a lefty bowler, you start with minus five per strike. <laughs> Because I that was the Steve, 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 Steve wow. rule. Uh, yeah, because. Sorry, nothing to the guys off, but look what Dave just left. Wow, the oh one, two, wow. one, two, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wow, we uh, yeah. He only get three pins out of it. Yeah. The three, look at five, four. Yeah. Three, five, four. I just well, that was. Wow. And he might make. Oh. Oh. Leaves a ten so pin. Close. Wow. Not to cut no, you guys so off, I just had to point that, that out. That was Thank you, Wayne. And, and he had eight pieces of wood in the deck now. So, I tell everybody that a left-handed bowler bowls on the side of the lane, it's only used 10 times of the time, 10% 10, 10 of the time, well, so they have to have an advantage. Well, oh ten, that 10 pin, because 10 pin, the oil, yeah. left hand has a little more advantage because the right, As it, it wears out the, wears out the oil, yeah, 10 pin. So you, know, you know what happened, you know what they did, they, I, I set my, I sent my request into the Bowling Association. Yep, yep. You know what their answer was? What? Tough shit? Yeah, no. Ask Steve if he goes out with his rowboat, if he brings the oars. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the old Steve roll. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I came up with some beauties. If you get it, if I you bet get they it, love you when they, you walk Oh, in. they know me now. I think, I know, this is Johnny Blaze. I'm the First one who ball. came up with you know what a mulligan is, right? Oh, yeah. Right. I wanted oh, to wait a minute. Him. Wait a minute. Here they go. Oh, oh, oh wait a minute. All over the oh, place. I thought they had a strike. Yeah, I so. wanted everyone to get a, so a, bowl and get a mulligan on a spread eagle once a, once a night. Oh, like golf? Yeah, like in golf. Yeah, in other words, you make one bad shot, you yeah. can get hit, it over. Hit the button. And they all laughed at me. Mm -hmm. Now, why would they laugh at me? I'm a good uh, nigga. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. And he, oh, he chops off the heck of this, and even uh, I won't take it. Well, what do you think, George? Oh. Should you get? Should you get it? No, no. no. Well, I suck at this squirrel? game, and even I don't. Squirrel. Accept the mulligan. A mulligan for a, no. No. <laughs> Richie, Richie's high single is one ninety nine. Get what you get. If I triple is four sixty nine. He bowls on the Wednesday night industrial league, and the extra pro league, and the, he bowls on the pro series too. He's a milkman. Amber, Amber, imagine that. Oh, Richie Myers. He blew his milk. Get the hit pin. Found it. Come on, another dog. Oh, All right. Another hammer. Nice shoot. Could have had three in a row. You want another good one, Rick? What's that? You know what else I proposed many years ago? What's that? You sink, you shoot in a single pin for ten bucks with yep. no wood. Yep. I don't know, it could be anything. The two six strikes, this whole strike. Single Not pin, no wood match. for ten bucks, and you miss it, you get an eight. No spares. If you Just make strikes. it, you get an eleven. Ah, uh, I see. You know it what happened on that one? And it, they told me to go out in the. They yeah, told me yeah, to go out yeah. my boat with a hole in it. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Puts like cement shoes on your feet, right? Yeah. And <laughs> you're getting all of them, yeah, 11 bucks without a max. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's like. Uh, only, only I would think of something like this. Dave I, think, I guess it. I drove him crazy, though. That almost well, happened. Yeah, that could happen. I still got all the letters, though. They, Dave, they, they responded to me. Dave gets a split. He has a 3, 6, 7, 10. Yeah, you can, can he cut it over? Oh, 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 you hit it. Nope, oh, nice right. try. Almost. I almost got it. Sure well, he's uh, he's fighting through the pain right now. So he might need one of those chill sambucas that. Uh, I know, right? And a few pills. I don't know if it's gonna, I don't know if it's gonna help though. Yeah, right, make sure a ten. Under the building shot. Yes, for a ten. So he's got fifty-five through five. You said you drive people crazy, Steve. That's hard to believe. <laughs> is that hard to believe, Amber? Steve yeah. drives people crazy. No, is that, He's getting I, screwed. That's, all, hard, that's I, hard to believe. I've always said there's nothing I don't know about Kendall from Bowman. Seven, eight, ten, guys. Oh my goodness. Seven, eight, ten. Again, Steve. Seven, eight, ten. Yeah. With one piece of wood, ink. Uh, it's, it's, it's in the, the front of seven, Myra eight, does ten. It too. Same string. Uh, that was his ship. The bowling no, gods the don't like him no more. No. He's got a slim shot. How does that I happen? Mean, how, how can your pocket hit the palms <laughs> and leave the back, the back three? Because it's not ten pins. Well, yeah, I, That's why. <laughs> I get a headache even hearing that word. He's got a I watch it on TV. All they do, eighty-five percent of the time, is strikes. I know. Yeah, it's a boring game. It's, it's, it's a nice try, Dave. That's a very right. good try. It's but a we all got to remember: if it wasn't for ten pin, this game would not exist. Probably, but this, ten pin's a boring game, though. 
Team up is more challenging, more I fun. I can pin. honestly say huh? that's true. I can't do ten pin. I can't no. pull ten. I'd ball duck pin it if I had a chance. I've done. My I do all three. Enough. No. Even for the lightest balls, like six pounds, I can't do it. Have you oh, ever? Yeah. Have you you never done them? What duck pin? Yeah. No. Oh, you got I'm gonna it. try this summer. I think. I'm, I'm not it. allowed to hold a duck pin ball anymore. We uh we had Josh Lowell up here one time for the show. Who and who was it? Josh, Josh Lowell. Josh Lowell. Yeah. And he's a duck pin bowler. Yeah, too. He is, yes he is. He bowls with squirrel. Well man. he yeah he brought out his duck pin ball because Dave was looking at it and I asked I was holding it for a second because it's slightly bigger yeah, than a candle pin ball and I dropped it and it bounced off his leg. Ooh. So uh, bounced almost, off his leg. So I'm not eagle. allowed. Uh, I'm not allowed to hold a duck pin ball anymore. Oh. Yeah, almost got a spread eagle. Your favorite shot, Steve. Almost but got you know, How does yeah, that almost happen? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, but they designed duck pins for women because they couldn't handle the big ball. Seriously. Well, that's why I like candle yeah. pin. I can't handle the duck and pin then ball. They the My hand's pins. too small. You want to read this? What he mentioned. This is he's a legend. Ooh. Ooh. He wants to mention him on the show. He wants to mention Charlie Dutras, his men mentor. He just passed away a little while ago. Oh. And he, he, Charlie Dutras was a wonderful oh, man. A he was a great guy, a great bowler. I saw him a number of times. He was an incredible guy. Oh, he can afford it, that. It's a shame that he passed away, but I think he was 88 years old when he died. I think 80, 89, 88 years old, but. He was a wonderful guy. Richie's Charlie, putting and, Dave to the Madela right now. He says he likes selling timeshares in Guatemala. That's what he says. <laughs> That's one of his uh, hobbies, selling timeshares. Well, he's got the, the two, four, five, one of the six Mongols. Yep. Very difficult. Pretty Not as easy. Pretty as selling it looks. some in Chernobyl. <laughs> you got it. You got it. You got it. He knew he had that one. He walked away like. That's because millennials don't know anything about that. So <laughs> they say this great prime land nice in Chernobyl. They're like, oh, great. Myrick. Myrick. That's good. It's fair. Yes. Yeah. Nice shot, Richie. Nice shot, Richie. You know, he said he he wants that to the show. An outtake reel. An, well, an outtake show. On our regular, on our on our. Uh, normal during the season show, uh, our OEPD has been working on that. We've got really. <laughs> there's a lot. Everybody's got, everybody has all takes on the shows, like all the bloopers. Oh, you guys have no idea. In the, oh, in the first man. few se in the first you know few seasons or so. Yeah. You've got uh, Dave and this guy Steve over there standing at the end of the lanes and you know Travis is taping them. <laughs> you you have no idea how many outtakes. Really? For some of them. How many what? Outtakes. Oh, that's, that's a oh, yeah. And on the regular show for the first time in supposedly seven years, Dave S. Bond. That's a spare for Dave, so maybe he can get a big fill and try to put some pressure on Richie, but he's down by a lot of pens. Which he actually S. Bond on this show on, uh, I don't remember which one, but on, in the first season he did S. Bond. Oh no. Oh wow. We stole a few. Yeah, you did. Oh, he's in Heck pain. He, he, he's in pain, though. Yeah. He hits the six pin and lands up on an eight drop with a spear. Yeah, he, he's in a lot of pain. Yeah, he's in pain. He's the nerve. He's got a nerve shot. Yeah, when you get nerve damage, it, yeah. it's my foot. My, my foot. I've got nerve damage. My foot still. In my right foot. In oh, the really? accident. It's still. Oh. It's it's tough. I, I could deal with muscle pain, but nerve damage, nerve damage. Nerve damage is one of the worst. Yeah, it, that's how to that's how to deal with. It hurts. It, it hurts. hurts. Yeah, yeah, it's tough. It's tough. I mean, it's, you, know, you need surgery. That's the only way they can do it. Some, you know, it's the only way you can do it, get surgery done. Because the pain pills really don't work. You know? Richie's on his spare. In the, he's got uh, 67 plus. Yep. And so he's in, yeah, uh, he's in control of the match. plus lead. Yeah, right he's, in, he's in control of the match. Wow. I say he's right in, on spear. I say he's in coach mode right now. Oh, you see, on tonight. Yeah, he's throwing a good ball. He is on tonight. He, he's throwing Talk a great. about candle pin ball. He yeah. got a 45 pin lead. Talk Maybe a double. Oh, double. Wow, nice ball. Wait a minute. Wiggle, wiggle. Get over. Oh, hey, the cups. I think the woods help stand it back up, bounce off each other. Yeah, yeah. I think they have one candle pin ball. He's there. Oh, no, he missed it. Slightly good, left. Roll to the left. But he's got a huge lead. Got a big lead. 106 for eight. Yeah, he's 46 pins. 46 up pins up, but two boxes. Another Especially good with lesson. Especially with Dave Hurt and that. When was the first automatic machine? 
in focus and play and where. I think it was the 50s, wasn't it? You're close. Because it was 1949. You know where it was? No. I found out. Really? Uh, Wayland Park. Really? At the oh, Academy Wayland Park. Yeah. Okay. Now, <laughs> the time that machine was invented, yep, yep. there was something like 45 or 46 Supposedly bowling houses. Supposedly, Dave is yeah. mathematically and eliminated. Hands not, people hands on by hand. Yeah, if he but happens the question to throw was, all straight every right house now. had a different diameter. Yeah. Diameter and wow. weight. Oh my they goodness! Moved. It no. moved. Oh, see, and it didn't how does it happen? The pin, the, the, pin, the, pin, the pin moves wow. sideways. How did that happen? Now, now, now he's well. Much. No, there's still yeah. Common Core math. He's still got that. Don't even get me. I'm not even going to. No. There was every. There was 48 houses you could bowl in Worcester, and all had a different size and weight and width of pin. Really? Yeah. And then the machine came, and that's when it got standardized. Oh, oh no! Oh. I missed it. That's when it got standardized. Throwing in the well, there's wooden, the wooden pins back then, right? Yeah, and, and the plastic came in the early 60s. 60s, yeah. Yeah, yeah they say if you were like a, if you were like a 110 bowler in, in wood pins, you were, oh, you were a good bowler. Oh, you were a good bowler. Now the other thing, you know, it's worth money. Now Dave is mathematically out of it. Candle pin. He needed that strike pin. when the pin moved. Underneath, halfway up on him where the strike is. Well, yep. going to the last put box. The see where you can end it with. It was oh, he did, really? And they stopped it. Please still be able to rest his arm after this. All right. So, and so nobody yeah, after that, who knows? But yeah, I know. Richie Meyer can get it. Pin. It gets uh, like a negative 10, then he probably has a chance. Yeah. No. Yeah. Wow. Nice ball, Dave. Strike. The last one. The hammer. The last ball. Yeah, you throw a strike. Yeah. Oh, that last one should have been a strike. That pin moved over. Moved inches. He, he is uh, a trooper. As, uh, well, if he's gonna lose, you don't want to lose by that much. He's a trooper. To to bowl a plus 120 game with his pain that he's in. That's a that's a that's a real trooper. Because mm. he's he's in pain. The action leaves the head pins working. He's a one, two, four, and the eight. See if we can make it for a spare. See if we can make it for a spare. To go out in style. See if we can <laughs> in the door hammer on it. Make it feel a little better, wouldn't it? Maybe. Oh, he gets robbed. He got robbed. No. No, but yeah. I'm 121, sorry. yeah. Oh, yeah, 121. 121. 121 game. Nice game. Nice game for Dave with being in pain. What, four and marks? Yeah. 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 Uh, five. He, well, he had uh, four spares and a, one strike throughout the entire match. So now, if Richie Myrick gets around a negative 20, Dave may still have a chance. Yeah, 30. Uh oh. Well, uh -oh. Almost. Looks like that's not eagle. Yet. Spread eagle minus a claw. That's right. The claw? A claw, yeah. Or a talent. Got into a fight, something, you know, bit it off. Oh, Spread yeah, eagle yeah, with yeah. a clip wing. The clip wing, yeah, I call it the clip wing. He found Did he the just go head. through the hole again? Yeah, there's a sound of a pad, hitting the pad. Hit, hit, hitting, the, hitting, the, hitting the mat in the back. Oh, oh, good a, out. A, or as he calls it on New England candle pins, finding the curtain. Yep, oh yeah. 114 through 9. Last box for Richie Myrick. And he already, he already threw a 139 yeah. in the first game. Before hey, this, Rick, Rick you want another theory? theory? What's up? Seven strikes and a spare. What would happen if you... Oh! oh now yeah, eight strikes and a spare. Yeah, I know. A backdoor strike this team. That was an interesting one. How does that happen? Then, yeah, I know there's a word Pour him salt on the wound here, Myrick. I know. How does that happen? As I said before, he slammed Dave into the Madela. George, I got, a, I got a mission for you. Oh. Find out what Salt and alcohol, just taking what? it, the pouring strike. it over. Yeah, that's the last awful. pin goes down. Is it all a double? There's a word gee, for it. Gee whiz. Slow. I don't think Dave was... What could Dave say? I mean, he's down by 50 and throws a backdoor strike. <laughs> oh, he almost uh, got right. 134 game. 134. And a 139 for a 273. Wow. That's good bowling. Scratch 273 to 228. So the yeah. winner, whatever is Richie Myrick. Myrick goes on next week to Isn't go against Johnny Blaze, the Ghost Rider himself. He's done. What's he doing? Isn't he done? Yeah, he's done. I don't know what he's doing. What's he doing? What's he doing? Well, let's find out. In the eleventh box. Yeah, this is not what we mean by the eleventh box. No. Welcome everyone to the 11th box. I'm Dave Madler, and of course, you know everybody knows who this is. This is Mr. Richie Myrick. And just like the show says, you watched Dave suck at bowling.
But kudos to Mr. Richie Myrick because, like the competitor that he is, he showed no mercy. He stepped on my neck, pulled off my arms, and like did a little thing down my neck. Richie, great job, kid. Uh, I appreciate it, Dave. Um, I don't know about that last part, about the neck thing, but uh, everything else I think you said was pretty much spot on. Um, I got lucky enough to have a couple of doubles against you, man. You bowled really well, so I mean, those types of things add up, so it actually could have been a closer match than, than it was, and you looked like you were uh, bowling with a broken wing for the most part, so I feel like I took advantage of a cripple at this point. <laughs> no, no excuses, man. I threw the ball. I stepped up the alleys, and um, I make no excuses. Now, no stranger. Next week, Mr. Johnny Blaze. Um, Johnny Blaze um, has been bowling out of his tree lately, and I'm not going to lie to you. If there's anybody that has me a little bit, a little bit, uh, you know, could be him. But he doesn't. No, no I'm going yeah, to. Nothing. Easy potatoes. <laughs> well, you know, him doing all that duck pin has made his arm just a little bit stronger. Well, it's almost like he's throwing a duck pin ball at the candle pins right now, the way he's been killing it. He's averaging like 150 at this place lately. Ah. Uh. I don't know, man. I, I think you, I think I think uh, next week you're gonna have your work cut out for you. Yeah, I'm gonna have some trouble. And uh, congratulations. Yeah. And uh, we'll talk to you next week. All right, sounds good. I hope so. See you all next week on the offseason King of the Palace match number four. In this event, Richie Myrick moves on, showing Dave Madla he is not the big boss. In next week's episode. Richie takes on the ghost riding elevator surfing squirrel Johnny Blaze with a 647 qualifier. So how will this go? There's only one way to find out and that's watch next week's episode of King of the Palace Summer Edition.